Hey guys, welcome back to Digital Celebs. In today's video, we'll discuss 10 of the worst ever celebrity fan interactions. Let's head into it. Number 10, Hugh Grant. According to a bouncer at a local bar, a chance meeting with Hugh Grant left him with an impression that the actor is a very unpleasant individual. In one instance, Grant had accompanied a young girl to a pub, and when she was refused entry because she had valid identification, Grant began ranting at the bouncer. Do you know who I am? And I bet you don't even have any education. To say something like that, especially to a celebrity, is quite impolite. By the way, did you know about these horrible fan encounters? Let us know in the comment section below. Number 9. Jennifer Lopez Jennifer Lopez was staying at the Melia Desdorf, a 5-star luxury hotel when she made one of the hotel maids lose her job. The maid had demanded an autograph from the celebrity, but she was not only refused, but she was also sacked after Lopez alleged a formal complaint with the management. According to the German tabloid Bild, the maid said, I did some cleaning on her floor. As a result, I summoned all my bravery and rang the bell in order to obtain an autograph from the singer-songwriter. However, I was turned away by two helpers at the front entrance. Miss Lopez has lodged a formal complaint with the cleaning business that I work for at the hotel and the firm phoned me the next day to inform me of this. I was fired on the spot, directly over the phone, because of an autograph, of course. Number 8. Orlando Bloom The actor, Orlando Bloom, stopped his motorbike in the center of the pavement just in front of the business according to a worker at a men's warehouse store in New York City. Is my brother back there? He said from the doorway, his sweatpants saggy and without a shirt on. His next step was to spend many hours walking around with the men's warehouse manager, choosing out clothing. When it was time to check out, he inquired as to whether he would be eligible for the Orlando Bloom is wearing my shirt discount. Number 7. Jeremy Piven In 2007, Jeremy Piven, star of the television series Entourage, and 12 other friends came up at the restaurant Nobu Matsushia in Aspen, Colorado, without making appointments. Despite the fact that the restaurant was incredibly full, a table was still reserved for the Hollywood celebrity and his entourage. As Piven walked out of the restaurant, at the conclusion of the event, he said to the manager, Thanks for absolutely nothing. Jeremy is also said to have left a gratuity of the server during season one of Entourage. According to reports, because of the event, the actor has been barred from entering any of the Nobu Mitsura restaurants. Number 6. Catherine Zeta-Jones One lucky eight-year-old girl was selected as the winner of a contest and was given the opportunity to attend an advanced screaming of The Mask of Zorro with the actors and crew. As soon as she saw her hero actress Catherine Zeta-Jones, she said with excitement, I want to be an actress too. When she met the diva, you're pretty enough, I suppose. Zeta Jones is believed to have to the little eight-year-old girl after looking her in the eyes. That's plain cruel, to say the least. Number five, Cameron Diaz. Strolling down the red carpet, which was surrounded with paparazzi and adoring admirers, as these types of events typically are. According to tradition, the red carpet is a platform for celebrities to advertise their projects and or themselves, as well as engage with fans and photographers. Diaz, on the other hand, does not see things that way. She responded to fans' requests for photos with Diaz with the words, if I did it for you, then I would have to do it for everyone, and then continued to walk away from them. Number four, Megan Fox. If you are both incredibly gorgeous and renowned, you will attract a great deal of attention, whether you want it or not. At times, being the center of attention may be unpleasant. Eventually, when you're simply trying to get through your day-to-day -day as usual, despite this, there simply isn't any justification for disrespecting your followers. According to Megan Fox fan, he approached the actress on the street in San Diego and requested for an autograph. Get this disgusting creep away from me, Fox is said to have her told her bodyguard in response. Number three, Janet Jackson. After a number of Janet Jackson's security officers arrived at the hotel to urge everyone to stop what they were doing and stand behind a line with their eyes dropped, a hotel employee in Dallas stated, Jackson, according to reports, had requested that no one was even 
glance at her, because they were not permitted to look at Jackson, let alone speak to her. It was clear that the whole hotel staff had a negative experience with her. Number two, Niall Horn. Niall Horn, member of One Direction and Heartthrob, arrived in Dublin Airport and was met by a mob of Directioners, as they are known where everywhere they travel, who screamed their admiration for the pop sensation and snapped photographs of him. Horn was irritated by them and was captured on tape ranting at them, calling them a shower of cunts in response. That was an extremely awful celebrity experience, to put it mildly. And number one, Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber reigns supreme when it comes to tragic celebrity encounters. When it comes to fans, he's well known for losing his cool and being downright nasty to them. There's even a photo of the pop star spitting on a group of believers from the balcony of his Toronto, Canada apartment building, according to reports. One of Bieber's most embarrassing celebrity incidents occurred when a fan approached him on a beach. She was supposedly wearing a bikini at the time, and Bieber referred to her as a beached whale. Spectator said that he also urged that she go out of the reality television show The Big Loser. That's some serious meanness. What do you think about these fan encounters? Which one do you believe was the worst one? Let us know in the comment section. This brings us to the end of today's video. I hope you had fun watching it. Give us a like if you did and subscribe to our channel to stay updated. Also, activate the bell so you definitely won't miss any of our future videos. And watch the two videos that are on the screen because I'm sure you'll love them. Enjoy your day and I'll see you in the next video!